Hi, I'm Joel Santo Domingo, lead analyst at PCMag.com. One of the innovations that came out of the March 2015 Apple event is the new Force Touch trackpad found on the new MacBook 12 inch and this new MacBook Pro 13 inch with Retina display. Force Touch essentially adds pressure sensitivity to the trackpad, along with haptic feedback that helps eliminate the physical springs in the trackpad. Traditional trackpads have a spring built in to let you know that you've clicked the mouse button. The physical springs would have made the new MacBook thicker, so Apple turned the trackpad into a non-moving plate with a haptic feedback. A motor moves a weight under the trackpad, which vibrates and makes a clicking sound that fools you into thinking you clicked the trackpad, even though the surface doesn't really move. It's kind of like the force feedback in a PlayStation controller, but more subtle. The haptic feedback works all over the trackpad, even at the top over the hinge where older trackpads don't click. The trackpad is also pressure sensitive, so you can use your fingertip to sign your name like you were using a pen, or use pressure to speed up fast forward and reverse functions in QuickTime. Pressing harder will also activate force click, which is like an extra right click. Think of it like having a third mouse button, and you'll see the added benefit in programs like Safari, where force click will bring up Wikipedia entries or dictionary definitions for the word you just clicked on. We see potential to use the force click in programs like architecture or CAD CAM programs to activate extra functions without having to use a toolbar on your screen. It takes a few minutes to get used to the new trackpad. We had some trouble activating force click when we meant to just click and drag, but eventually your finger will learn where the force click threshold is. If not, you can disable it in the trackpad control panel. We look forward to seeing Force Touch in new devices like the Apple Watch and future MacBooks. Force click aside, the haptic feedback is uncanny and you likely won't miss the old mechanical trackpad. For reviews of the MacBook, MacBook Pro, and thousands of other products, check out PCMag.com.